Well, well, congratulations, and been appointed head coach of the club. How does it feel to be sitting in this position today? I obviously delighted. So thank you. Uh, I'm over the moon to be honest with you. I've, I've enjoyed enjoyed my time. I've enjoyed working with the players. It's been really, really good. Uh, and then the opportunity presented itself uh, over the weekend, and it was a case of uh, let's speak and, and see how far we can get this. But I have to say, over the, the pre-season overall, the, the, the players have been great with me, and that was probably one of the, the convincing factors of how good a relationship that, that I have with them. And how do you feel that benefits you the fact you've had you've been working with them since you came in in December? You, you know the squad, you know. The fitness levels just now as you walk in the door is in a new position. How, how does that benefit you in the, the weeks ahead? Well, I, I'm not coming in blind, so I know I know all the individuals are in here. Uh, I know the players. I know I know what we need. Uh, so that's that's a head start. And obviously, over the, the past uh, two and a half, uh, two and a bit of weeks, where they've been doing pre-season, I know what, which level they're at. So uh, developing those relationships and personal relationships with them, getting to know them uh, first and foremost is is a their assistant uh, last season and then now uh, being their, their their leader and their manager and uh, we've developed lots of uh, different relationships throughout that time good and bad uh, obviously when, when things aren't going well they need to be told and likewise uh, they've came to me with different things so there's a, a trust element there as well and that's always important uh, but I've really enjoyed it so far and as I said it's an opportunity that that's presented itself to me and one I couldn't turn down and we expect from, from a team that's, that you lead is it's obviously been working as a coaching staff but now as, as head coach what can fans expect to have from you? Uh, I think obviously the way the way I am uh, energy that's first and foremost you'll expect energy from, from anything that I do whether it be speaking to yourself or, or time with my kids or uh, training that will be energy there'll be lots of energy there'll be lots of uh, endeavour uh, and there'll be smiles on people's faces there'll be enjoyment uh, Try to create an environment where where people uh, love doing what they do, and, and even when it's not going well, they still love trying to make it better. So that's going to need to be uh, a focal point of it. But as I said, it's one that we need to go and, and build and develop and and trying to make uh, as best as we can. Just over a week to our first game of the season against Dundee. It's quite the it's quite the start for you. will be in and around the cup fixtures before you know it. Yeah, I mean, obviously Dundee, a, a place I know. Uh, relatively well, having been the opposite side of the street, uh, so ten days now until until that starts. And really looking forward to that. Really looking forward to the first competitive fixture. The players have done great pre-season, uh, but obviously when it gets to this stage, the first part is can we get the run out of the way? Then it's can we get any games? And now it's can we get the the friendlies out of the way and get any competitive games? And they're really looking forward to that. Uh, obviously we've got some games before then we're looking forward to, uh, but. The first game of the season can't come quick enough. Uh, obviously, we're looking to to bring in some some players, and hopefully, we can do that over the the, the next few days. Is that anything? I mean, obviously, fans will be be itching to know if there's if there's anything in the pipeline that can give us any information. I'm not telling. <laughs> hopefully, uh, hopefully, the next few days there will be uh, people to excite and players to excite people uh, and players to drive players that are in here, and I think that's important. And hopefully, we can do that. And as I say, it's, it's a positive thing. Uh, people pushing pushing others to be their best and that's what we need to have in here. And finally, take, take it after being first team coach, how uh, you obviously know the importance of a first team coach having been one. Is that a, a process of finding the right candidate? Is it going to be one that you, you look to get done pretty soon or is it one you've got to take your time? No, it's, uh, it's massively important to me uh, having the, the right guys around about and the right guys around about the, the players. Uh, so... I know who, what we'd like to do and we've already started working on that so hopefully we can continue that over the next next few days and uh, it needs to be some someone that's influential and can help people learn uh, and bring the right uh, enthusiasm uh, with them and I'm sure uh, that'll be sorted in the next coming days. And finally, get a message to the fans obviously they'll be itching to, to see in competitive action but a message before then? Uh, Really looking forward to it. Put your seatbelt on, it's going to be a good journey, uh, and I'm excited with it.